my husband had asked me while I was pregnant with our daughter if I would be okay with not posting her online. He gave me a lot of reasons that he felt it was an invasion of her privacy. He felt like uh, she didn't have the ability to consent to her image being out there. It felt really isolating at first um, because when your baby is a newborn, you're home so much, especially as a mom, you're you know trapped under a baby that you're feeding and really all you have is your phone as a lifeline to the world. It was tempting to want to post it. Um, and then I went through a long phase where it wasn't as tempting and now she's talking and she's doing things that are really cute and funny. But I found for the most part that just sending it to a group text so that you can get a couple people's reactions kind of scratches that same itch. I would get texts from people saying, I haven't seen her in so long. What does she look like? What is she doing? What has she learned? What is she eating? And it felt so much more like they really cared about our family because they were taking that extra step of reaching out to us instead of just clicking like when they scrolled past a picture of her. Once I sort of got past that initial phase, I started to realize that this actually was a blessing in disguise. Since my social channels were kid free, it forced me to take stock of the things I was doing that didn't involve her and then post about them. And that made me feel engaged with a part of my personality that I might have lost touch with otherwise. What I try to do is look at a moment that I wanna share and ask myself, am I the main character of this moment or is my child? And if the answer is my child, then it's not gonna get posted because that's her life story and not for me to put online. But if the answer is me and my child happens to be there, then I will cover her somehow in order to share that. My personal platform is not that parents need to stop posting their kids altogether, but I think it is a valuable exercise to think about what it would be like if you Googled yourself now and found out that all your bath time photos were online, um, or whatever, not even bath time photos, but you know, everything you ever did was hashtagged and archived. She'll never have to go through that moment of being like, you need to scrub the internet of me, mom. I can't believe how embarrassing all this is. Obviously, <laughs> I'm sure I'll do plenty of other embarrassing things, but that it's, it's a big relief to know that that's never a conversation we're gonna have to have.